A New York judge has partially granted a petition from the Pirates of the Caribbean star to determine if her donated the entirety of her $7 million divorce settlement to the American Civil Liberties Union and to the Children's Hospital Los Angeles as she pledged. Johnny Depp triumphs over Amber Heard's $7 million divorce settlement. As a result of the ruling, the ACLU must release documents that confirm whether Heard followed through on the donation promise, which has become a point of contention in the former couple's legal saga. Mr. Depp is most gratified by the court's decision, Depp's lawyer Benjamin Chu said in a statement. Depp lost a libel lawsuit in London against the publisher of The Sun tabloid, which had labeled him a wife-beater in a 2018 headline after Heard accused him of abuse in Los Angeles in 2016 as they were ending their short, volatile marriage. The case pitted Depp against a powerful tabloid and its editor, with Heard as their star witness. In March, Depp was refused an appeal after his lawyer, Andrew Caldicott, argued that Heard's donation pledge was a calculated and manipulative lie that tipped the scales against Mr. Depp from the very beginning. Caldicott alleged one of Heard's intended charitable beneficiaries, Children's Hospital Los Angeles, wrote to Depp's business advisor in 2019 saying Heard had not made any payments. Lawyers for The Sun's publisher rejected the arguments in court in March, saying Heard did not lie about the donations because she was pledging to pay the sums over 10 years. She had made a number of payments already in pursuance of these pledges, said Adam Molansky, representing newsgroup newspapers. The high court ruling came after a three-week circus-like trial in July, during which Depp and Heard took the stand and both were damaged by lurid testimony about drinking, drug use, fighting and room trashing. The judge ruled that the great majority of Heard's claims of abuse as presented by the tabloid's publisher in its defense were mostly true. Proceedings now move to Virginia, where a separate case arose after Heard published a column in the Washington Post in December of 2018, proclaiming herself a victim of domestic abuse and suggesting, without actually using his name, that Depp was the alleged abuser. Three months later, Depp filed a lawsuit in Fairfax County, where the Washington Post is printed, seeking 50 million US dollars and accusing his ex-wife of defaming him with hoax allegations of domestic abuse. Heard shot back by filing more than 300 pages of documents in Virginia, expanding on the abuse allegations she lodged against Depp during their divorce in 2016 claiming Depp regularly beat her up before she married him in 2015 and continued to do so during their 18-month marriage. In her Virginia filing, Heard attached multiple pages of photos of herself with bruises on her face, scars on her arms, and hair allegedly torn from her head, plus pictures of wrecked rooms, broken glass, and overturned furniture that she says Depp inflicted on their home. She included screenshots of dozens of text messages describing these incidents at the time and excerpts of their divorce deposition describing shocking abuse. But Depp went a step further in the Virginia case in May of 2019, saying that while mixing prescription amphetamines and non-prescription drugs with alcohol, heard, hit, punched, and kicked me. She also repeatedly and frequently threw objects into my body and head, including heavy bottles, soda cans, burning candles, television remote controls, and paint thinner cans, which severely injured me. As evidence, he submitted a photo of his black and puffy eyes and scratches. The actor also detailed an alleged attack by Heard one month after their marriage in Australia during his described efforts to get Heard to sign a post-nuptial agreement. Depp said the conversation resulted in the severing of his fingertip from a shattered glass bottle thrown by his then-wife. A rare victory has sided with Johnny Depp, but the lengthy legal battle against his former wife Amber Heard has not yet arrived at the finish line as he attempts to determine whether she made good on her promise to donate 7 million US dollars from their divorce settlement. This attempt is due to Heard's statement after their 2016 breakup that she didn't want Depp's money and promised to donate it to the American Civil Liberties Union and Children's Hospital Los Angeles. According to USA Today, a judge has partially granted a motion filed by Depp's lawyers in New York Supreme Court requiring the ACLU to reveal records confirming whether or not Heard kept her promise. 
In a statement to USA Today, Depp's attorney Benjamin Chu said, Mr. Depp is most gratified by the court's decision. However, Heard and the ACLU have yet to respond to the outlet's request for legal comment. This happened months after Depp lost a libel action against the publisher of the newspaper The Sun in November when Heard accused him of being aggressive and abusive. Depp was sued by the tabloid and its editor and had dubbed him a wife-beater with his ex-wife testifying for the latter. Adam Waldman, the lawyer for the Pirates of the Caribbean star, previously stated that Amber Heard did not donate the full sum she pledged. He published papers concerning anonymous donations made to the Children's Hospital and found out that in 2017, the hospital received $500,000 and in 2018, another $250,000. Waldman later concluded that the donations were not from the divorce settlement money, but rather from anonymous donors. He also chastised CHLA for allowing her to utilize them. On the other hand, Elaine Bredehoft, Heard's attorney, acknowledged in January that her client had yet to complete her $7 million pledge to the CHLA and ACLU, citing financial concerns. She also brought up Mr. Depp filing a lawsuit against Amber, and as a result, she had to spend millions of dollars defending Mr. Depp's baseless charges against her. Johnny Depp has won a rare victory as he attempts to discover whether his ex-wife Amber Heard carried out her promised donation of her $7 million divorce settlement. The Aquaman star pledged to donate the money to the American Civil Liberties Union and Children's Hospital Los Angeles after the couple split in 2016. However, Depp's lawyer Andrew Caldicott has argued that the promised donation was a calculated and manipulative lie that tipped the scales against Mr. Depp from the very beginning. He also alleged that the Children's Hospital Los Angeles wrote to Depp's business advisor in 2019 to inform them Heard had not made any payments. A New York judge has now partially granted a petition by Depp's legal team which will force the ACLU to release documents that confirm whether or not Heard followed through on her pledge. Depp's lawyer Benjamin Chu said in a statement to USA Today that the Pirates of the Caribbean star was most gratified by the court's decision. Giving evidence in a statement dated 26th of February, Heard stated, I remained financially independent from him the whole time we were together and the entire amount of my divorce settlement was donated to charity. Judge Andrew Nicole cited the gesture while deciding the Libel case in the Sun's favor, commenting that the donation of the $7 million to charity is hardly the act one would expect of a gold digger.